What's going on, apes? Welcome back to the Zane Investing. We appreciate you joining us today and your support. I have a wacky AMC update for you. As bank stocks suffer a massive loss, massive margin calls are imminent. Make certain to remain around. Click the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel before I continue. I wonder how many current shareholders we have. Do you believe there are more than 4 million stockholders or fewer than 4 million? There have been numerous bullish pieces of news about AMC recently, including the formal announcement that the AMC co-branded credit card with Visa would be discontinued in the first quarter of 2023. The increase in box office numbers and great news from the other verticals that Adam Aaron and the executive team have continued to pursue. But one of the most optimistic bits of information is that people continue to adore AMC. Adam Aaron stated that as of the most current available figures, there were over 4 million AMC shareholders who own between 80 and 90% of the corporation. And with more members joining every day and the ape community becoming stronger, it is only a matter of time before the short thesis is completely disproved and hedge funds are rendered obsolete. But this is hardly the only good news we've received, whether from AMC or elsewhere. As the broader market continues to cope with high inflation and rising interest rates, and based on what we continue to observe in a number of Wall Street titans, we anticipate further market volatility. Things are rapidly heating up. Suspended POS tweets. Sheesh. Eventually, margin call will have to come in hot. Cannot last forever. Either banks will vanish or HDFS will join them in the same boat. Eventually, Flex is unable to prevent the ship from sinking. Some will abandon the ship before it is too late. There are no buddies on WS. Several verticals have experienced a steady decline in stock price, with tech and bank stocks suffering the most. Whether it's embattled Swiss lender Credit Suisse, Goldman Sachs, or JP Morgan Chase, the decline in investment banking revenue, coupled with the massive losses they've incurred in their mortgage origination businesses, has put them on the brink of collapse. With roughly $2 quadrillion in derivatives wagers, it is just a matter of time before the margin calls begin to affect the larger financial institutions as they did the smaller ones. According to sources, more than 2,000 margin calls are issued each month, and numerous companies have been forced to liquidate the result. Even if modest dominoes are falling at the moment, the situation is about to worsen. Yet they continue to assert that streaming is the future and that AMC is dead, while increasing their short bets. Following Digiday's bullish report, Netflix shares fall. How about we choke that down? During the pandemic and even prior to the hedge fund's inception, Hedges guys initiated short bets in AMC and GameStop with the belief that both companies would go to zero after filing for bankruptcy. It was a decent wager at the time. The apes had not yet developed the community that we have now. And because people were locked up and unable to go to the movies, there was a convincing argument that streaming would ultimately prevail. However, due to the vast amount of streaming alternatives and the reality that many desire nothing more than to experience escapism outside of their homes, escape rooms are becoming increasingly popular. People are now flocking to their local AMC to enjoy everything it has to offer as AMC fortunes have revived strongly. Cameron stated that the film would need to become the third or fourth highest grossing film of all time for it to be profitable. But based on what I've heard so far, there's a persuasive argument that it may be headed for the top slot, with the potential to generate billions of dollars and demonstrating once again that consumers are prepared to pay for the theatrical experience, particularly in AMC premium format offers. If AMC plays its cards well, it might generate hundreds of millions of dollars in revenue from this film alone, according to my intuition. Consequently, hedge funds continue to scream streaming and defer responsibility. AMC is in a precarious situation. The conclusion of this video. Always ensure that you scroll to the bottom of the page. Tap the thumbs up button for me. And while you're at it, subscribe to the channel. Go obtain some free stock using Mimo. The link is included in the description. Acceptable thank you for supporting and viewing our station. Regards from the moon.